Well, hello, friends. This right here is Logan, one of my little grandsons. Look at him. And he's a maniac. He's out here helping me this morning in the barn. And I'll tell you what, he's got more energy. I wish I had half his energy. But he wanted to say something to you guys this morning. Go ahead, Logie. Merry Christmas, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. I don't know if you guys ever ran around with a three-year-old in a barn or not, but I'll tell you what, you want to keep your hands full, that will keep your hands full for a fact. But he wanted to tell everybody Merry Christmas. So here we go. Luke 2, 11. For there is born to you this day in the city of David a Savior who is Christ our Lord. Friends, what else do we say? I mean, there is nothing more to add to that. That is great news, isn't it? Jesus was born into this world. We take this time of year to reflect upon that and to be thankful for it. You know, let's not forget the reason for the season. And I know I said that last week, but I just want to reiterate it this week. As we go out again this week, you know, not only this time of year, but, but just start a trend this time of year and let it carry all the way through the rest of your life. That you start to allow the Lord to soften your heart to be a more loving, a more caring person. We all need His help to do that because we all want to live in this carnal world and that is far from that. So we have to rely upon Him. So it's not what you do, it's who you know and who you know will change what you do. Let's really remember that this season. And, and, and as we change this season, that we take that change and let that change grow throughout our lives to, to become closer and closer to Jesus. And the closer we become to Him, the more people are going to realize that, the more people are going to ask you questions. How is it that you're different? And why is it that you're different? It gives you an opportunity to share the love of Jesus with somebody. So, let's focus on that as we go out this week. And as we go out and continue to grow our relationship with the Lord. Till next week, God bless.